Oh, oh. If you came on yesterday, yeah, still saw from yesterday, me too. My hammies, my arm and my shoulders. Good work for showing up again though. Oh. All right, so this is gonna be a booty and ab workout, if your booty can handle it. Oh. And ever. Oh. Does anyone know what day it is? Is it Monday? I've ran out of knowing what day it is anymore. You tricked us, yeah I did, sorry. <laughs> oh, uh. You guys wanted it. Alrighty. Okay, so, I've got 31 people. So, um, I'll just give you another couple of minutes. Um, but a couple of you have messaged me and said, Danny, but I don't have bands. <laughs> well, <laughs> Just in case you didn't know, <laughs> I sell them. I put the discount code below. That's for my bands and for the meal plan. You get three bands. So you get a black one. I didn't want to do this as a plug, but a black one, which is your most uh, strongest one. Ooh. And you get a gray one, which is your middle one. So I use this one for some side raises and some arm workouts. And then you get the pink one, which is what I use for arms. Okay, so you get 35% off because you watch the live workout, so the discount code's below, it's live workout, and I'm pretty good with postage most of the time. Little plug. Shush. Hang on. Hang on, let me go get my child. <laughs> All right, are we ready to go? Can Chris please join? He has to watch Harper, otherwise it's not gonna be fun. I should do this when they're napping, but everyone's baby's naps at different times, so it's hard. Um, yeah, so you get your three bands, you get your carry bag, which is really cute, and you get a workout as well. You get a video workout um, with exercises to do with them, so yay! All right. Hunter will be joining the screaming soon. Perfect. Love babies and toddlers are crying. Harper's lost her shit. I think she wanted to get involved. All right. So same thing as yesterday. So we're gonna do a little bit of a warm up, which is what seems to kill everyone. Um, then we've got three rounds. What have I got here? Three rounds of booty exercises. So you're gonna burn. And then we've got some ab killers at the end. Now, as yesterday, I will do some, sorry, I'm just gonna sort this music out. Um, alternatives, um, but most of this is pretty low impact. So um, it'll be fine for most. It'll just be when you get to the abs section that some people are gonna have to do some alternatives. If you are pregnant post 14, 12 or 14 weeks, you shouldn't really be doing any abs. It's gonna be all about breathing, really securing that pelvic floor. If you're postpartum and you haven't been cleared, again, you shouldn't be doing it. Just really focus on that pelvic floor. So um, just make sure you look after yourselves, listen to your body. Um, and obviously listen to your body anyway if you're not feeling up to it. But if you are, nothing happens in your comfort zone. So let's get going. All right, each time I will explain, then we'll do it together. All right, so our warm up. We're gonna run on the spot as fast as you can. If you're pregnant or postpartum, just jog. Um, then some in out squats. So we're gonna go out and back in, out and back in 10 times, and then just 10 little quick skip jumps. Just little ones. This is just to get your heart rate going, okay, at the start of the workout. So we're gonna do that three times. You ready? Three, two, one, let's go team, on the spot. One, two, three, four, five. In out squats, 10 of them. One, two, just squat if you're pregnant. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. 10 skip jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Back to running on the spot, go. One, two, Warmer. 
All right. Now, if you haven't got bands, that's okay. What you're gonna do is really engage your glutes every time you do a movement. I'm gonna use my black band. Round one, 30 monster walks. Your position is really important during these. So I'll show you. Slight bend forward at the hips, tummy in. Really engage those glutes. We don't wanna be here, we don't wanna be here. We wanna have your bum sticking out, legs slightly bent. With a monster walk, we take a step to the side, we bring the leg in but not all the way. Step to the side. So each time, you engage your glutes. You can do this without a band as well. 30 of those. Then 10 side raises each leg, nice and controlled. You can use your grey band for these. Then we're gonna do one and a half squats. Band comes above the knee. We squat down, we come up halfway, back down, and all the way up, squeeze at the top, engage your muscles in your core. Make sure your feet are hip width apart at all times during the squat. Back nice and straight. You right, you ready? 30 monster walks. So core in, slight bend from for the hips, engage those glutes, slight knee bend. Let's go. And one, two, three, four. Keep that tension in the band. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Halfway. 17, 18, 19, 20, 10 more, turn on, two, four, really engage those glutes and that core, two more, good, straight to side raises and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nice and controlled, you should feel this in both sides of your glutes, other leg, one, two, Three, I'm already feeling the burn. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Band above your knees. One and a half squats times ten. Let's go. Legs hip width apart. And down, halfway up, down and squeeze. Down, halfway up, down and squeeze. Want to activate all the muscles you can. Squeeze. Down, halfway and squeeze. Five. What, five more and down halfway and squeeze halfway and squeeze as low as you can go weight in your heels squeeze two more core in good job down to your ankles again straight back into it monster walks let's go 31 nice big step keep that resistance don't bring that leg all the way in guys you want to keep the resistance in the band five six Seven, slight bend of the hips, core in. 12, 13, 14, 15, halfway, 16. Keep that tension, slight knee bend, tip forward from the hips just slightly, stick that booty out, it should be burning. 21, two, three, four, three, six. I'm four, three, six, I'm sorry if my counting's off, 28, 29, then, and side raises, let's go. Upright and one, two, three, four. Engage that core, you should feel it in both sides. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other leg, Woo! One, two, can you feel that burn? I can. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! Bands above your knees. Again, if you don't have a band, that's okay. Just really engage those muscles. I'll show you side on. Fit heat width apart. Let's go. And all the way down. Halfway, down and squeeze. Halfway and squeeze. Down, halfway and squeeze. Good work, guys. Awesome work for showing up. This is going to make you feel better for the rest of the day. Get those endorphins going. Feel of accomplishment. Keep your body healthy. Keep your mind healthy. Hope everyone's doing okay during these times. It can be really hard. Two more. Halfway and squeeze. And squeeze. Back down to your ankles. Last round. 30 monster walks. Let's go. This is a killer. One, two. Engage that core. Six. Woo! Eight, nine, ten. Stick 
that booty out. I'll show you from the side. Yeah, nice and strong through the core and your glutes. Keep that tension in the band, halfway. Keep that breathing even. 10 more. Keep that tension in the band. Want to walk out of this coronavirus with buns of steel, yeah? Side raises, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, woo, 10. That opposite glue, huh? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo, would you put the black band on? You're killing it. Well done, let's go. Squats, halfway down. And squeeze, all the way down, halfway up. And squeeze, try and get nice and low, weight in your heels. Squeeze, four, woo, five, and squeeze, six, woo, seven, and eight. Two more, all the way down, halfway, down, and squeeze. Squeeze each time you raise and squeeze. Good job. Grab a drink. Keep your bands on. Oh, how are those glutes? Burning? Oh, mine are burning. Oh. All right. Can you hear the music or is it just me? All right. Hey. All right, I'll show you. You keep drinking. Right, we're gonna do squat with a side raise. Kickbacks, this is gonna kill. And then a wall sit with a leg opener. So you just need a wall of some sort. I'm using my tank. If you don't have a tank at home, you may use a wall. <laughs> I think I'm going crazy. All right, so watch me first and then we'll do it together. We're gonna do squat and a side raise. Squat and a side raise. Again, if you don't have a band, that's okay. Sideways, really controlled, okay? 10 each leg, so 20 in total. Bands down to the ankles, kickbacks. Nice and controlled, just like the side raises. Ten of them. Try and keep it going straight behind you and straight back. It's really about the control, engaging those lower glutes. Bend back above the knees, over to your wall. Into a wall seat, you want to be 90 degrees. You don't want to be too high, you don't want to be too low. Yeah, 90 degrees. And then we've got 30 leg openers. Nice and controlled. All right, we ready? Hydrated? Let's go. Ten on each leg. Squat and raise. Squat and raise. Squat and glutes activated. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, halfway, eleven, twelve, thirteen, woo, buns on fire, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, woo, 19, one more. Good job, guys. Down to your ankles, kick backs. Nice and strong through the core, just moving your leg. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Swap legs, you should be activating your opposite glute as well. So the one you're standing on, one, two, Tummy's in. The more you activate your abdominals during all your exercises, the stronger your core is going to become. Core doesn't become strong just from doing ab exercises. Two more. Become strong from activating it at all times. Back above the knees. No, what are we doing? Wall sit. Down we go. 30 and one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Nice and controlled. Thirteen. You shouldn't be going any faster than me. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Keep that core in. This is how my long tongue comes out. See that? When I feel like this. <laughs> what are we up to? Twenty-five. 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Good work. Woo! Straight back into squat raise. Let's go. Squat. Up. Squat. Up. Woo! Every time you come up, you want to suck those buns.
comes in. Whoa. Activate those glutes every time. Six, seven, eight, nine. Your bumps are gonna kill tomorrow. Halfway. I'll give you guys a break till Wednesday. And then I've had some requests for some afternoon sessions. So Wednesday we might do afternoon. Four more. Four. Three. Woo! Two, keep getting nice and low. Don't slacken up. Bands below the ankles. Kick back. So let's go. One, two, three. Nice and controlled. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, other foot. Leg. Now I'm going crazy. See? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, back above the knees, over to your tank, or your wall, <laughs> into a wall sit, let's go, and 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, tummy in, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, this should be burning, 15, halfway, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 10 more, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, excuse my facial expressions, 4, 3, 2, 1, Woo! good work, last round of this, squat raise, make sure you get nice and low, and squat, up, 2, 3, if you need to change to the grey band or take your band off, that's okay, but you need to be pushing yourself. Only if you're in excruciating pain. <laughs> Seven, eight. I've also, I think, worked out how to save these guys. So not only will it be live on my story for 24 hours, I'll save it and I might even pop it on my YouTube channel so it's just always there. 12, 13, nice and low, 14. Drive the floor away when you come up and drive. And drive the floor away, really push it away. Four more, three, two, one. Those buns should be on fire. Back down to the ankles, kickbacks. Let's go. If you haven't got a band on, that's okay. Really control movements and activating of those glutes will get you a burn. Four, five, tummies in. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! Have a leg, let's go, good work guys. Should be so proud of yourselves. Turning up, so easy to get stuck in a rut. Oh. Oh. Three more, two, one. Right, back above the ankle and knees. Over to your wall. Last sentence round. Whew. Let's go, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, halfway, no, not halfway, the other way. 12, 13, 14, 15. My little nephew in England did my workout yesterday and messaged me before I went to bed and said, Daddy, I'm gonna go to bed dying. <laughs> so it's good to see. Lots of different age groups. I think he's 12 or 13, which is awesome. Eight more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Go drink. Whew. Quick drink, then we're going to do a little bit of a car racer before the next round. How are you feeling? Awesome. Discount code doesn't work. Definitely does work. <gasps> no, it doesn't work. You know why? I didn't change the date. All right. Okay. I'll fix it now. All right, now we're gonna go while I'm doing this. Run the spot for five seconds. In out squats again, just like the just like the warm up. Sorry guys, I had it um, finishing last night. So let me just. 
I'll do it after this. I'll make sure it's live after this. All right. Five seconds in that squat, just like the warm up, three times. And one, two, three, four, five. And one, two, three. You should get your heart rate back up. Four, loosen those muscles. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right on the spot, go as fast as you can. On the race. Three, two, one, and ten. Go. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Last one. One, two, faster. Three, four, five, and ten more. One, get that heart rate back up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, good work, heart rate back up, good job. Let me just reactivate this one for you. Active date, let's put it there. Sorry my lovelies, all done, right. You can use black or you can use gray. I suggest using grey if you haven't done a lot of booty workouts. We've got on your mats donkey kicks, then hip raises, and then single leg hip raises. I'm going to give you some options for the hip raises depending on your level. So, band's going to stay around your knees. You've got your donkey kicks. Nice and quick engage core, up and hold. And then we're gonna do a side fire hydro at the same time, up and hold. So 10, each leg up the back and to the side, like a dog peeing on a fire hydrant. That's how I like to explain it. 10 each leg. Then you're gonna flip around, you've got your options. Hip thrust, just on your backs. You go up, hip opener, close, back down. Or if you're feeling advanced, stick your heels on a chair and really get that whole hamstring and glute activation. So you're gonna go all the way up, open, and down, okay? You've got two options, on the floor or on the chair. Then you've got single legs, the same thing. On the floor or on the chair, single legs, 10 each leg, okay? Either on the chair or on the floor. I'll tell you right now, on the floor is bloody hard, so don't feel like you need to do it on the chair. It hurts on the floor. Let's go team. And donkey kicks with a fire hydrant. We go up the back, up the side, up the back. At the side. Get those glutes going. And at the side. Five. That's halfway. Slight hold at the top. Whew. Two more. Woo! One more. Ah, oh, other leg. And up the back. And fire hydrant. Like a dog peeing on a fire hydrant. And at the side. At the back. Engage that core. Side. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Three more. At the back. At the side. At the back. At the side. One more. Woo! Are you pulling funny faces too like me? Hope so. Right, choose your level either on the floor or on the chair. I'm gonna start on the chair, I'll probably end up going back down to the floor. We got one, leg open, back down. Two, you can definitely do this without a band with your feet on the floor as well. So choose your level. <sighs> Woo! Feel those hammies and those glutes. Halfway. Six. Woo. Really roll through that spine on the way up and the way down. Nine. And ten. Into single legs on the chair or on the floor. We go up. Ten each side. These are a killer. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Holy shit. Nine. Ten. You might want to take your band off for those if you need. And other leg. One, two, three, 
four. This chair is killing me. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! Yuch! Back into your donkeys and your fire hydrants. Hope everyone's buns are on fire. Hope it's not just me. <laughs> Let's go up the back, up the side. And two. Good work, guys. Three. This is your last booty round. Then we're into abs. Woo! Six. Seven. If you need to change to the grey band, that's okay. This is a killer. One more. Keep those abs in. Other leg. One. I want to thank you guys for showing up as well because I actually work harder knowing you guys are out there. And I need to push for you. And it makes me work harder, so thank you. And thank you for your support as well. It's awesome. Five more. Five. Whew. Four. Three. Two. Oh, last one. Oh. On two backs. The chair's going for me. Can't do it. Oh. On fire. Let's go. Hip raise. Leg open. And close. Two. And close, nice and high with the hips. And down. And down. Keep those abs nice and secure. And roll through the back. Seven. And eight. And nine. And 10. Single legs, woo! Here we go. And one and two, and three, and four, and five, holy shit, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, oh my god, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, good work guys, holy moly, one more round. Woo! Let's go. Woo. And one. To the side. Somebody asked the other day, if they just do my workouts every day, is that enough? If you want to do what's right for you. You need to mix up the workouts, which I'm trying to do for you guys, to make sure you're activating some different muscles each day. You don't want to be doing the same thing. You don't want to end up with a massive, massive tush and no arms, or, you know, the opposite. Three more. But you need to do what makes you feel good. I love going for a run every second day. Makes me feel really good. Other leg. You might want to go for a bike ride or a swift walk. You might want to do some yoga. Do some meditation. Some stretching. Whatever feels good for you. Just half an hour. Get hubby to take the kids. <laughs> Three more. And two. And one. Excuse my cat. <laughs> Onto your backs. Last round of hip raises. Oh my goodness. Hope you're burning as much as me. And one. Leg open. And down. Leg open. And up. And down. Squeeze right underneath that bum. All through your glutes. You've got three glutes. Three sets of glute muscles. You want to make sure all of them are activated. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. I'm taking my band off the single leg. My bum is on fire. Let's go. And one. And two. And three. And four. And five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and ten. Holy moly, other leg. And one, and two, last set, and four, and five, and six, and seven. Keep going. You've got this. Nine, right away to the end. Ten. Good job. Woo. Holy moly. Have a quick drink. 
We're gonna do a heart racer before we get into abs. Mm. Ow! Are you burning? Oh, awesome, Jess. Sorry about that before. Cool. <sighs> All right. Right on the spot. In out squats just to get your heart racing and into some abs. Ready? Is everyone feeling? So, five, five counts. Ten in out squats. Three times. Just get your heart going again. Loosen up the muscles again. One, two, three, four, five, and one. Just loosen them up. Nice and loose. Four, five, six. Does that feel good? Oh, it feels good for me. Eight, nine, ten. Again, five counts. One, two, three, four, five, ten. Good job. Just want to get that heart rate up again. So you really, your muscles are really warm. Nine. Last round. And go. Five seconds. One. Faster. Two. Three. Four. Five. And ten. One. Two. Just nice and easy. Just to relax those muscles again. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. All right. Ab time. All right. Watch me, then we'll do it together. I'll give options as well. We've got single leg raises, 20 of them. If that's too hard or you can't do it, I think you do toe taps, okay? If you're pregnant, early postpartum, stay in this position, head back, really concentrate on your breathing, okay? Just breathe, five counts in, five counts out. Everyone else, we've got single leg raises. Oh, hi. Hi. Wanna say hello? Then we've got kick outs. We've got out, in, out, in. 15 of them. 15 kick outs. Then we've got Russian twists. I'm gonna use a five kilo weight. You can, you don't have to. You can do it either with your feet on the floor, back nice and straight or you can do it with your feet off the floor. 20 of them. Again, if you're pregnant or postpartum, you shouldn't be doing any of this. Lie on your back, legs in the air, and really concentrate on those breathing. All right, ready? Single leg raises, 20 of them. One, two, keep that back nice and flat on the floor. Hey, munchkin. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Core nice and locked in, no arching, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Straight to kick outs. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You've got 15, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Good job. Straight into Russian twists. Choose your level. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, sixteen, three more, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Good job. Back into single leg raises. If you're really advanced and you want to do double leg raises, be my guest. One, I'm gonna do half and half. Two, nice and controlled. Three, four. If you just want to be doing toe taps like this, that is also 100% fine. You want to add a crunch into it. That's fine too. What are we up to? 10, 11. Keep that back nice and press into the floor. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Right, straight to kick out, up you get. Hands behind you and out and in, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If that's too hard, just keep here and just do one leg at a time. Yeah? 14, 15, four. Oh, that's the last one. And Russian twists. Choose your level, feet on the floor, feet up. Weight, no weight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 19, 20. Good job. 
One more round, then we're going to the next one. Choose your level. Leg raises. One, two, three, four, five. Now you guys can do as many abs as you want, but I hate to be the bearer of bad news. If you want to find abs, they're made in the kitchen. I am not being a good example at the moment. I had probably five rows of chocolate last night. I think that's probably half of one. But usually, a nice lean diet with a little bit of treats will help that fat loss around your tummy. Well, fat loss everywhere. And that's when you start to see that definition. Three more. Two, one. Straight into kick outs. Let's go. But a good core will help your pelvic floor. It'll help any back problems you have. It'll help your posture. Whew. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Whew. All right, last one. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Keep going. Right to the end. 15, 16. Good job, guys. 10, 20. Oh. All right. Round one abs done. Grab a drink. Two more ab rounds. All right, watch me while you rest. We've got beetles, crunches, and side obliques. Beetles, opposite arm to opposite leg. All right, opposite arm to opposite leg, and switch, and switch, and switch. If that's too hard, you can just do normal bicycles. If that's too hard, just touch your toes, okay? The three levels, beetles, okay? Bicycles or toe touches. Then we've got just normal crunches, feet on the floor or feet 90 degrees, just to your shoulders off the ground. Everyone thinks you have to come all the way up. You don't, then you start using your hip flexors and your back, just halfway up, so your shoulders are off the ground. 20 crunches. And into side obliques. Onto your side. Lift up your legs and your head. And back down. And lift. Back down. Okay? Great job. People are saying things. Let me see what you're saying. Oh, Chris, yeah. I wouldn't be able to do that. <laughs> Harper is wearing a plant. Yes. If you can't do it, as I said, you've got some options. If you can't beetle and you can't bicycle, just touch your toes. Okay? Crunches. Just have your feet on the floor and crunch. Side obliques, you should be right. Let's go. And 20, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Into your crunches. Choose your level. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Don't forget, six, this is supposed to be hurting. This is not here to make you feel relaxed. This is here to make you feel burning and strong. Whew. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. <laughs> Onto your side. Head and legs up. And one. And two. And three. 10 each side, four. I'll probably do like five minutes of stretching at the end, guys. If you guys want to join me, just let me know. Maybe give me like a little yoga emoji if you want to stay around. Otherwise, I'll turn it off. Two more, nine, 10. Onto your other side. Feet together. Lift both feet right to the side. You don't want to twist. You want to be literally to the side. Three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. Back into your back, back into your beetles or your option, whatever you want to do, whatever you find is works best for you. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20, in two crunches, choose your level, feet on the ground or feet up, one, two, just your shoulders off the ground, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, you should be burning, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, keep going guys, 16, it is gonna hurt, that's okay, you're not gonna die, I promise, onto your side, side obliques, and up, and two, and three, and four, you've got four sets of abs, You've got your rectus abdominis, which is what forms that nice six pack, you see? You've got your transverse abdominis, abdominis, which wraps you up, like that. And then you've got your internal and external obliques, which is what gives you that nice definition there. One more, other side. External obliques go down to your pubis down there, and your internal obliques come up. So that's what you see when you see that little definition there. I want to make sure you're using all of them. If you just do crunches all day, you're only using one of them. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One more round of that, guys. Choose your level. Beetles, bicycles, or just toe taps. Choose your level. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, I'm still watering the plants. They're already watered. It rained yesterday. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20. Into some crunches, choose your level, feet on the ground or feet up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Keep going, this is probably burning. Burning for me. You got this, guys. This is so good that you showed up. It's a long one this morning as well. <laughs> I'm killing you. And sides. One, two, slight hold at the top. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Flip around. Killing it. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Munchkin. Alright, well done guys. Now, we're going to do a one minute plank or as long as you can go, okay? I'm going to count it back for you. I'm going to see how long you can last. You want your arms, I always hold my hands under your shoulders. You want your bum nice and flat and you want your core engaged. We'll do a minute. If you get to 30 seconds, that's awesome. Next time we do it, you're going to go a little bit further. We're just going to do a minute as max though. See how fast you can get. Ready? We take a deep breath and start in five, four, three, who knows how I love playing, two, one, let's go team, you can do it. Who's gonna get to a minute? I wanna see your hands up when you get to a minute. Shoot me a little fire emoji, you can make it. If you can't, that's okay. If you get to 20 seconds and you've never played before, it's freaking awesome. The fact that you're trying new things is amazing. What are you doing? <laughs> ah! Hunting of the year. <laughs> Alright, halfway guys, that's 30 seconds. If you got there, that's awesome. If you're getting to, you're get to a minute, you've got 20 seconds to go. Who's with me? That's 50 seconds if you got there, amazing. 10 seconds to go and you're in a minute. Five, four, three, two, one. Who got there? Who got there? Did you do the half -er? Awesome. How are you guys feeling? Woo. Oh, abs are pumping. Oh, man. Are you all dying? You think you're probably all, yay, go Caroline. Amazing. Good work. Awesome work, guys. Yay, Lisa. Guys, awesome work. Grab yourself a drink. Give yourself a round of applause. Pat on the back. Go, Katie. Yay. Oh, good work. Dead. Me too. Whew. All right. I'm going to hang around and do a little stretch if you want to join me. Legs killing. <laughs> Love it. Awesome work, guys. If you want to hang around, I'll do a little stretch here. 
Just some of my favorite stretches to make sure you're getting all those muscles strength out, stretched out that we use today. Dying, I know. I feel ya. Um, like I said yesterday as well, I'll talk to you while I'm stretching. All right, we've just done our abs. So grab, jump onto your tummies and just stretch out your abs. Step one. Now, as I said yesterday, you wanna have some protein in the next 30 minutes. Okay, you've used some big muscles groups today. Glutes are a big muscle group. So you wanna make sure you repair those muscles. Having protein within 30 minutes is the best way to do that. So that can be a nice lean forward, arm up. Can be a protein shake. Can be a tuna tuna, can be an egg, can be my protein balls, my protein muesli bars if you're doing my meal plan, can be a banana bread, your protein banana bread, could be some chicken if you want an early lunch or a snack, some cheese, all, some good, all good protein, some edamame beans, good protein. Make sure you stretch out those pods. Oh, feel good. I feel good. Always feel good. Stretch out those hammies. Oh, they might still be sore from yesterday. Oh, yeah, they are. Oh. And you want to make sure you hydrate, guys. So, if you're drinking three to four litres of water a day, you're breastfeeding, absolutely. Sit around, stretch out those inside thighs. Oh, I always have a bottle of like this big. This is 750 mils. Always around on me. Make sure I get it in. It'll help you with your blood flow, your oxygen levels in your blood. It'll help with bloatedness. If ever I'm feeling bloated the next day, I can tell you right now, it's because I haven't drunk enough water the night before. Oh. Other leg. Oh, hi. hi. Yeah. It helps with digestion. Thanks, darling. Where's the lid? Mm, I don't know either. Where do you go find it? Hi. <laughs> Stretch out those quads. And also, it's good to have water on you because, especially in times like this, a lot of people are eating because of boredom, going to the cupboard, looking in the cupboard 50 times a day for snacks. Sometimes you're not hungry, you're just dehydrated. So make sure you have your water on you and always have a glass of water before a snack or a meal just to make sure, oh, thank you, you're not dehydrated. Oh, how are those hammies from yesterday? Holy moly. Oh, into your inside thighs. Um, I've reactivated that code, guys, sorry. So live workout will get you 35% off bands and meal plans. All right, make sure into those glutes. A couple ways you can stretch out your glutes. I like to stretch them out this way. I feel like it gets a nice big stretch out here. Or you can lie on your back as well. We use a lot of glutes today, so make sure you stretch them out, otherwise you'll be extra sore tomorrow. If you guys have any questions about my meal plans, let me know. Happy to answer them. If you guys want the one week free trial, I will happily send it to you if you send me a DM so you can give it a go first. Some yummy things on there. Oh. Oh. All right. And hamstrings and your calves. Don't forget, everyone forgets their calves. Make sure you stretch out your calves. Oh. And the other thing as well guys, if you are struggling with your nutrition, yeah. I'm happy to do, I'm doing a little nutrition check, health check calls. There's like free, it's a free 15 minute chat with me. Just talk about like where you're struggling, where you'd like some help. If you have any questions around nutrition, you're just confused, or you just don't know how to stay on track. I popped a link in my stories, so you can just Schedule in a call with me. Oh, stretch up nice and high. I am a qualified nutrition coach, so it's what I love doing. I love food, so you're not gonna get told just to eat kale from me. I do love kale, but I'm all about balance. Chocolate, wine, and goodness. All right. Whew. All right, guys. Hope you had a good time. Mwah. Let's do it again on Wednesday. I might do an afternoon session. Um, I'll put it out to you all, but I've had some requests for Wednesday afternoon and then maybe Friday morning. Thank you so much, Anne-Lan's mom. Oh, hi, Jack, thank you. Awesome. All right, guys, have a great day. Hope you feel good. Um, share your stories with me. I'm gonna save this. I don't have to work it out. Apparently I press end and save. Wish me luck. <laughs>